Hi guys, this is the lady. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. Um, as I search for the truth, my journey to Jehovah, uh, in this day and age, you guys, I know a lot of people are doing the same, searching for the truth, you know. We really need to know now, especially, you know, who is God? Um, who is Jesus? What's our purpose? What you know? What 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 are we what are we doing here? And that's you know where I am. That's where I'm I'm searching. And so today we're going to be uh, talking about who is God. And um, I'm gonna get to my Bible reading. The truth. All right, you guys, so the truth about God and Christ Jesus. In my last video, I I call God Jehovah. Uh, I called him that because that is his name. Uh, in the Hebrew language, his name was Yahweh, or that's what we, we translated into Yahweh. Uh, actually, it was four letters, and so it was translated to mean Yahweh or Jehovah. And of course, God goes by different titles. We have Lord, we have Savior, we have the Great I Am, uh, Father. Uh, all of those are just titles that we... Some say that calling Him Jehovah um, is disrespectful and so they don't think calling him by his name keeps it holy you know uh, it's too personal but in my studies in Psalms 105 verses 1 it reads give thanks to Jehovah call on his name it's that Jehovah God wants a relationship with his creations. Um, he wants us to get to know him. He wants a personal relationship, a one-on-one, -on -one, if you will. And, and um, just like, you know, uh, us, you know, people know us. They, they, you guys know me as the Lady of Lace, uh, the Lady at 50, the Ageless Beauty, you know. Um, but my friends, my family, people who know me on a one-on-one -on -one, uh, personal level, they call me by my name. And that's why we call on Jehovah's name, by his name, because we have developed or we are developing a relationship with him. He has written that he wants that kind of relationship with us. Um, so God himself says, I am Jehovah. That is my name. That's written in Isaiah 42 and 8. Now God is an invisible spirit. The Bible confirms that no man has ever seen God. You guys, okay? No man out of all the time uh, of creation, no man has ever seen God. Now, what is the difference between God and Christ Jesus? Well, Jesus is not God. Jesus is unique. He is the only person created directly by God. That is why the Bible calls him God's son. After creating Jesus, Jehovah used his firstborn as a master worker to create everything and everyone else. So when in the beginning, in Genesis, when he said, let us create man in our image, that's him and Christ Jesus, creating everything and everyone together. No, they're not the same person. They are different. Jesus is the Son of God, His beloved Son. In Proverbs 8.30 and 31, it reads, 
Then I was beside him as a master worker. I was the one he was especially fond of day by day. I rejoiced before him all the time. I rejoiced over his habitable earth, and I was especially fond of the sons of men. I was beside him. That is Jesus talking. That is our Lord and our Savior. Jesus never claimed to be God. Instead, he explained, I am a representative from God. When speaking to one of his disciples, Jesus called Jehovah my father and your father. My God and your God. So you guys, this is uh, a big thing for some people because some people think that God and Jesus are one. But just like when you have a son, when, when we have children and our children imitates us, we always say, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, they're your spitting image because they are imitating what they see us do. Well, the same with God and Jesus. Jesus imitated his father, but he is not the father. This to be our first lesson because it's very important that we don't, that we get this right, that we, we understand that Jesus and, and Jehovah God are two different entities, two different spirits. Um, they are not one. They are one in the, in the fact that Jesus is doing God's will. That's what they are one in, but they are not the same. So, oh my goodness, I can't believe it's already 10 minutes. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna stop here. This is what is written. This is what is in the Bible. And, um, and I know, you know, for me, I believe the Bible. I mean, and um, I'll leave those scriptures that I read from in the description and we will continue our study and our journey to Jehovah searching for the truth. This is the lady at 50 signing off for now. Be blessed and a blessing. Bye bye.